Hey guys, uh, Van back at you here again with a little update. Uh, this is update from my box stock build. Um, getting closer all the time. All right, I've got it all. Like I said in uh, the question that CT asked in that video, uh, I've got it. Uh, everything cut and buffed and uh, polished out. Um, I've got just now got all the windows put in it. Uh, got them taped down and glued. Uh, just waiting for them to cure. Um, I got the headlight bezels in, and I put the the blue dots in two of the lights. Um, got that. I'm ready to put the lenses in, and uh, got the mirrors, uh, the chrome for the mirrors. I got them put in. Um, the only thing I like on the interior is the third brake light and the console it, it, for the overhead and the mirror. Uh, the rear view mirror in this thing was uh, all chrome and uh, I touched it up with uh, a little bit of flat black. That way it'd match all the interior. Um, this car right here, there's a few things that I've tried for the first time. Um, on this build, um, I tried clearing over my decals, and that uh, that's just great. I love it. Uh, I really didn't think you could do that until I seen it here on YouTube. But uh, uh, I like the way it uh, turns out. It looks you can't even tell it's a decal. Um, I've got uh, where I print up some of my own decals and everything I'm going to have to try some uh, experimenting on that I don't know if you can clear over that stuff or not but uh, anyways uh, I've about got this thing ready to go uh, all I'm waiting is for these uh, the windows and everything to dry where I can get everything put in uh, I just I love that color at lime ice that, that's a beautiful color um, I've got a uh, uh, Chip Foose 112 scale Camaro, and don't be surprised if that color finds its way on onto that and somehow or another. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's uh, about all I've got. Uh, I've run into a problem on uh, this box stock build. Um, I was getting it all together, putting the front end on it, and uh, uh, I was pressing the wheels onto the axles, and the whole thing just broke. just right across the center right here. So I'm having to uh, glue it, and it's been glued for several days, so it should be ready to, to uh, sand out just a little bit and touch up and get everything back in line. But uh, uh, I can get that fixed here pretty soon. And, uh, of course, right here's what... Uh, this is what the interior tub and the engine looks like. Um, I've got the engine painted, I don't know if you can really tell or not, I've got it painted Hemi Orange. Uh, and uh, got the heads painted aluminum, of course the front where all the serpentine belt and everything is, uh, I've got it all painted aluminum. Um, I'm gonna do just a little bit of detail and I think on some bolts under the hood before I put everything together. But uh, uh, the exhaust turned out real well. Uh, I painted it nickel like I do all my exhaust. And then I went around it with a little uh, brass uh, where the uh, connections is where it looks like it's burnt just a little bit. Uh, I don't know if you can tell right along in there or not on this camera. But uh, it adds just a little bit of detail to it. Um, I'm going to have to get me uh, some all clad and I'm going to try to learn how to paint with that stuff and they've got uh, burn exhaust color so I'm going to get some of that where I can start airbrushing a little bit of detail on it. Alright guys that's about it for the box stock. Um, as soon as this one uploads so I'll get uh, uh, the video done for the cancer build and uh, hopefully uh, I believe the next time y'all see this box stock uh, I believe she'll be done so 
uh, we'll get these windows glued in, the headlights and taillights in, and uh, go from there. All right, guys. Thanks.